Hey y'all, what's going on? God Tank coming at you again with the wifey. Uh, we're making some Fideo today. Some uh, homemade Fideo. What's this consist of, Mama? What kind of meal is this to you? A quick, easy meal with some noodles and meat, basically. Yep. Got some onions, garlic, and some jalapeno. Right there. Let's get it up here. We're going to make this a hamburger meat, y'all. So. Mm, it smells so good. Add a little bit of oil at the bottom there for it to kind of blend everything together. Be right back. I'm going to just saute a little bit, y'all. Stay tuned. Hold on, we're back on. Get my book. We're making the good stuff, y'all. Here we go. We've got the hamburger meat. You drop it in there. Yeah. Time to hook it up, y'all. All right, there we go. Let's turn a little bit. Very pretty now. Can it do What we put in there? Season off. Season off. Make a little season all off in there, y'all. That's some chili powder. Okay, chili powder. About how much are we going with there, honey? Just a little bit. Just a little bit. Maybe Depends a little bit. how hot you want it. How hot you want it. But we did add that jalapeno and that serrano. We added, we added the jalapeno and the serrano. We got ground cumin. Gotta have this, y'all. Boom! Any Mexican household gotta have that right there. Mexican American. Here we go. Right here, Mexican white boy. Right on. Honorary. Honorary Mexican. All day. Mmm, y'all. Smell it. It's all gravy. Tomato sauce. Boom. Okay. We'll see. Uh, okay. We'll see. Oh. Fish. Motel. Motel. Diced tomatoes and green chilies. Boom. Okay. There we go. Let's stir that around. Looking good, y'all. I told her. There we go, y'all. Yeah. <laughs> that all tomato sauce. I knew that shit was gone, y'all. Alright. Now, got some vermicelli. This is your fideo for all you people who don't be cooking with it. Vermicelli. Vermicelli. Boom. Putting that there. Good call, baby. Good call. Then we got some beef broth. Beef broth, y'all gonna add to it to finish off the uh, vermicelli here. We're calling that beef broth, baby. We're calling it, baby girl. Feels good, girl. Yeah. How do you? Ooh wee! Looking good, y'all. Is that about it, huh? You gotta wait for that to simmer? What are we doing? Mm -hmm. Cover it. Put it down to medium. Let it simmer for about 15, 20 minutes. Alright, y'all. 
We'll be back when we're trying to plate up. Peace. All right, y'all. Time to serve it up. That's what it looked like. Mm-hmm. Like Mexican spaghettios, I guess. Yeah, something like that, y'all. Could make eat that with some corn tortillas and some guacamole. Yeah. There we go. Yeah. Bon appetit, y'all. Try it, Mom. You try it. You try it. Let me try it. Try it. Mm -hmm. All day. Hope y'all enjoy. Make it with your family. Peace. Hey, y'all. What's going on? It's God Tank. Just wanted to share this with y'all real quick. This is a Lost Boys piece that I'm working on. Uh, this is going to be... Uh, my new logo for my COAs and everything so when you buy a, some prints from me or any artwork or a, have a custom uh, commission cover done for me I'll send this with a COA and uh, this is the original artwork underneath it and then I just added this to it so if you, I got a bunch of COAs printed up on this nice paper so whenever y'all buy something from me, you get this awesome. I think it's pretty cool, man. Let me know what y'all think about those COAs, man. I really enjoyed making it, and hope y'all like it too. God bless and peace. What's going on, y'all? It's your boy God Tank coming at you with today's comic book call for May twenty seventh, twenty twenty. Don't want to keep y'all waiting, man, so I'm going to get right to it. Of course, I got my main man, Aquaman, here on the cover with Ocean Master going at it. Straight fire cover. Straight lit, dude. Check it out. Freaking awesome, dude. I love it. Just an awesome cover, man. Look at that. Love it, man. Throw down for the throne. Freaking amazing, dude. Aquaman, of course, my number one favorite dude. So I had to get that uh, B cover. Not sure who this is done by. Oh, T Tyler Kirkham. Excuse me, I see it right there at the bottom. Check that out, y'all. Straight flame, look at that. I do prefer the short hair, old school, you know, like Aquaman, like this guy right here, but when they draw it this good, man, you can't help but love it, dude. Freaking amazing. Love the detail on that. Next up, got Mercy, number two. Nice cover. Um, great story. I heard this one was a great issue, too. I can't wait to get into this. Probably one of my first reads tonight. Enjoyed the first one. But uh, can't wait to see what her powers are about and all that kind of stuff, man. What, what she's about. But really cool cover. I had to go with that one. Next up, this is uh, King of Nowhere. This is number two. And uh, this is the FOC variant, I believe. I had to get this one. It's kind of crazy. Love the colors and those dragons, Komodo dragons, whatever they are. Awesome cover, man. Like those virgin covers they do for these. Next up, got that Cat Shit one. This is Volume 1, Issue 2. I did not get to read the first one yet, but I'm going to go ahead and read them together. So this should be pretty dope. It's kind of like a... Uh, take on Vietnam War, but with instead of uh, humans, it's with rabbits and cats. So it's kind of weird, but kind of neat, dude. Check it out. My dad was a Vietnam vet, so check it out. Next up, got that Avengers 
had to get this. Um, not, I don't read the Avengers that much, but I wanted to check this out because I heard good things about this Moon Knight. I really like Moon Knight and uh, the Age of Kushando. Kush okay, I don't know what that said, but part one. I want to check that out. Awesome cover, dude. Enjoy Moon Knight, his origin uh, story I read not too long ago. is pretty dope, so I, I like where he comes from, what he's about. So we'll check it out, man. See what that's about. And next up, <laughs> got that freaking flame. Vampirilla. This is Vamp Vengeance of Vampirilla number four, I believe. This is the Virgin variant. One in 20, I believe this is. And uh, I had to get this one, man. I don't get many cosplay variants, but this is the first cosplay I've ever seen that it actually actually looks like a drawing, and it looks like the actual, you know, Vampirilla. Like, not trying to be fake or nothing. Like, that looks like Vampirilla to me. Freaking dope. You know I love my vampires and all that, so this one right here, dude, is a must. Glad I've got that one, dude. Next up, everybody, one I'm sure everybody's getting today is that Venom number 25, uh, Donny Cates goodness. Uh, I heard it says something about uh, Noel in here, I believe, too. Also, we'll have to check it out, man. I'm not sure. But pretty dang dope, dude. I love this cover, man. I'm not sure who did this cover. It is a variant edition. This one is $5.99 this week, so has a little bit of uh you know thickness to it though. You know, like you could get a good read out of this. Pretty dope though. And uh, last but not least, this one a lot of people didn't know about coming this week, but uh I kind of knew about it and had my feelers out there feeling around for it, but I was able to pick this up, man, for cover. This is that Blackwood. The morning after Peach Momoko cover, man, straight up flamage. Now I do, I do not read this comic book, but I do collect Peach Momoko, and this one right here is just straight up flame. And I do believe it's going kind of crazy on eBay a little bit right now, maybe thirty or forty bucks. I'm not sure exactly, but check that out, y'all. Some of that Peach Momoko goodness, man. You know. She always comes with that flame, dude. Freaking dope. But, just wanted to share that with y'all. Hope y'all had a great day today. Hope everything's going well with everybody. Staying safe out there. God bless each and every one of y'all, my friends. And, uh, much love. Peace out. Show some love to Aquaman. It's no respect out there in the ocean. Peace out, y'all.